Hi, I'm Tiffany. I'm an education team designer for SwirlyDoos.com and today I'm going to be sharing how I made this little ATC type uh, shadow frame and I put a little um, like little stand on the back so it could stand up instead of just having a flat ATC like this one. So um, what you're going to need is three strips of chipboard or um, maybe cardboard from like a cereal box or something to where you can layer them um, to make the dimension on uh, right here. Okay, so this is about a quarter of an inch by 12 inches. And you're gonna cut them in um, fours. Okay, so, so you're gonna need those. You're also going to need um, your stickers from the Technique Kit or any type of stickers. And another little piece of um, chipboard or cardboard. And I don't have the dimensions on this. I just cut it out. So just kind of so it fits on the back. Okay. And you can paint this or whatever too. Um, also a little frame like this one here. Uh, some lace or some trims and I'm going to use these eye candies here. They're so really cute. They are from Creative Imaginations. I'm going to use um, this butterfly and this little ATC here. Also I'm going to use this little Prima flower. Okay, So let's get started and I'm going to cut these. So what you're going to want to do is, I don't there's no really exact measurement, so I just take them, I put layer them on top of each other like this. Let me move this stuff out of the way. Okay, and so I just put it like this and kind of make an indent on the top one with my fingernail there. I don't know if you could see that. And then I just cut them, all three of them together, just like that. Okay, and then three of a, two of them, I'm sorry, are going to be the same um, length because they're going to be the sides here. So kind of get a rough. And you can also paint these or color them if you don't want, um, you know, the, the cardboard color. Okay, and then we're going to do the bottom. And you gotta remember that this is gonna be kind of down there, so you don't wanna put it fully across. So it's gonna be just um, from this part to this part right here. Okay, so layer them again on top of each other. This is really easy and it's really cute because then you can display your ATCs on your desk or if you have a scrap area room um, then you can um, do it that way and then the same on the top so the top and the bottom are basically the same and then the sides are the same so get that I'm just gonna cut it off like that Okay, and first I'm going to glue these all together, the three, I'm going to layer three of them together. And so next thing you're going to want to do is um, put the chipboard, and you can even make it more dimensional just layering more pieces together. Um, but that's, this is perfect for me. So I'm going to um, adhere these. Okay, so next I'm going to take the frame and I'm going to put it on um, this little ATC card. So I'm just going to eyeball this. Okay, so just like that. Okay, we can put the butterfly. Um, I think I'm wanting the butterfly about there. And I'm going to use some hot glue for this part. Just like this. And you can do your ATCs any way you going want to it. tie a little bow with this lace here I got this at a thrift store I'm 
So I'm going to add the glue just like that. I'm going to add that to the top as well. Just like that. Okay, so super cute so far. Um, but I'm actually going to um, put some of these cute little blings on there. And then I have this here with my... Um, this is just some uh, multi-medium and um, I'm going to take it and it just sticks to it like that. Okay, and then I'm just going to run it through the glue there and um, it makes it really easy so you're not fussing um, with them or whatever. Okay, just like that. Oops. Take another one. Okay, so super cute. And now we're going to add the stand to the back. And like I said, you can paint this or um, whatever. But um, you're going to want to put it about maybe a half inch um, up from the bottom. Because there is, if you do um, the exact same ATC, because there is this little um, decorative bottom here. And I'm actually going to use some hot glue for this. And I just folded it kind of in half, so just like this. Okay, just like that. Whoops. Super cute. Almost forgot my words. Okay, um, I wanted to put on here sweet friend. So let me see where I want to put them. I think I'm going to cut the lace a little bit more here. Okay, so put sweet friend right there. Just like that. Okay, so really cute. And um, now I'm going to share with you my other ATC. So this is the other little shadow frame that I made. Or shadow ATC stand picture. <laughs> I'm not really exactly sure what to call it. Um, there's that one. And then I made this one here. With the, um, if you get the Technique kit, um, it comes with some cardboard ATCs. The corrugated cardboard. And then one is um, I kind of did the same concept of the frame type of AT. Okay, so this one I did that image transfer um, that I showed a while ago and it's really easy you just um, this was a, um, a canvas ATC which I got from Michaels and um, it had the you know the sticky on the back so I just put the the ATC side with the pattern down on the sticky side and then just wet it and then just rubbed off the back of the um, the card to kind of make a image transfer onto the canvas. If you have any questions please feel free to ask and I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you guys post your um, ATCs um, using this um, kind of technique or um, how I made them and thanks so much for watching. Bye!